Pleasure to be joined by all three of the Hughes brothers, 20-year-old Quinn, of course, who is a defenseman with the Vancouver Canucks, 18-year-old Jack, a center with the New Jersey Devils, and 16-year-old Luke, who's with the USA U-17 team. Boys, I know you're all together back in Canton, Michigan, and let's get right to this Bauer video of you guys rollerblading against each other. Uh, that was cool, but I understand this is just part of an entire mini Olympics that you guys have going on. Is this fair? Um, you know, uh, we were lucky enough to be sent uh, rollerblades a couple days ago, so um, we were pretty bored uh, before that. So we've been doing that a little bit, and um, yeah, it's been good. You could have let us know. We could have televised something like this because we're a little desperate for sports at this <laughs> time. I want to run through all the activities because I had a heads up that you guys compete in a few different things, and each one of you gives me a version of maybe who would be the first pick in a pickup game. So first of all, the roller hockey. I don't know on that. It depends on the day because we can't really we can't stop, and sometimes you can't stick handle if like the roads are wet or there's a ton of rocks. So that's uh, that's kind of depending on the day. Quinn. Yeah, I'd agree with that. I mean, um, you know, it's hard to play a game here too with three guys. So uh, we're not doing too many games. We're kind of just doing one on one on one or two on one. So. Um, yeah, I'm not really sure. I think, you know, it depends on the day, like Jack said. I expected a little more ripping of each other. Maybe Luke can, <laughs> Luke can chip in there. No, I don't, I don't think so. I mean, I kind of agree with him. I, I mean, we only have three guys, right? So we're kind of just doing, like, two-on-ones and stuff like that. What kind of brothers are you? Brothers are supposed to fight and brag relentlessly. Uh, okay, <laughs> other activities. Basketball. Come on, who's the best basketball player? Start at Jack's end again. I'd say Quinn. He's won, like, four or five tournaments in a row. Um, so I think Quinn's got our numbers there. Yeah, I, I would have said me a couple of days ago. I, I won, you know, we did one-on-one -on -one tournaments and uh, I won like three or four in a row. But then the last two days, Luke's been beating me. So um, as of right now, Luke's the best, I would say. <laughs> Fair enough. Ping pong. I would say Jack. Um, I mean, he's won, he's won the tournaments and kind of stuff like that. Um, but like any, any given day, it's, it's different, so. Yeah, I completely, I completely go against it. I think Luke hasn't beat me since I've been home, and Quinn got me in one series, and that's about it. So, yeah, I think I have their numbers in ping pong at least. That's more like it. I understand you guys have been working on your game in different ways. Uh, Quinn, you and Luke studying video. What have you seen? I mean, just like little things, like uh, if, he's, if he's pointing stuff out and stuff like that. Yeah, so. I'd say not, nothing too serious. It's pretty light, just, um, just you know, for me, I like to do it just in case, you know, we go back and um, I want to keep, you know, my, my game fresh. And um, so me and Luke will get bored and we'll watch something, uh, you know, clips of his game because I don't get to watch him too much during the year. So it's just, you know, a little fun thing to do. Jack, a rookie season, there's a lot coming at you. And now you get this, this unprecedented pause to sort of look back at it and then look forward. Is there anything you've been working on? Yeah, obviously it's a uh, a crazy year, but I mean this time was good. First week or two, kind of just debrief and uh, and hit the refresh button. But uh, recently we've started the workout four four or five times a week. Um, and me on a personal note, been watching a lot of film with uh, skills coach Brandon Narado. Kind of refresh my mind, uh, thinking new opinions, listening to new things when it comes to my game and, and different games, but. I mean, it's been pretty good, a pretty good time for me to hit the reset button and, uh, and learn some things. I feel like I've been watching uh, Quinn and Jack for years now, and Luke, maybe fans out there haven't seen you as much. You're a top prospect for the 2021 draft. Is there some NHLer you would compare your style of game to? Um, I mean, three guys I, I really like to watch are uh, obviously my brother Quinn. Um, anything I can take from his game, uh, I do. So, um and then Zach Wierenski and Charlie McAvoy. Um, those are two guys I, I really like to watch. Quinn, uh, lots of talk this week about resumption of play scenarios. I know there's still a long way to go, but at least there's a plan and there's some buzz right now. How eager are you to get back on the ice and how motivated to stay ready? Yeah, I think I'm very eager. You know, um, I, I know just as much as you. We haven't really heard much, uh, you know, obviously – Safety is the number one, um, you know, thing here. But I think we, we all want to get back on the ice here and um, see a scenario of the playoffs played out. 
um, whatever that may look like. But, uh, you know, part of that is trying to stay in shape and mentally stay um, ready. So I think, you know, I think me and Jack have done a really good job at that just in case we go back. And, um, you know, like I said, we don't really know much, but we'll see what happens. Listen, guys, really appreciate the time. Uh, best of luck and look forward to seeing you back whenever that is. Yeah, thanks, James. Yeah, thanks for having Thank us. Thank you.